Yes, indeed, it's six o'clock and it can only mean one thing. The doors are open once again for another one day special. And my word, what a one day special am I bringing you this time? We are talking Matthew Palmer, but what we're also talking is one of the biggest bundles I've seen since I've been here. You are getting so much. You are getting so much in here at an astonishing price. But let's introduce the man himself. He's in the building. He's here for a full one day special. Uh, and Matthew's here. How are you? I'm excited. This is going to be very good. excited. I am. I can't wait for this. This is this is going to be slightly different. So during every one day special. So you've got me now. You've got Leonia eight. You've got Paula twice tomorrow. And you've also got our Scott. We will be painting along with Matthew during the live hours. Okay, everything is set up. We're all good to go. We've all got separate areas, so don't worry about that. We will be painting along as the hour goes on. Um, just throw it in now while we're on. You can also be painting along this Sunday at watercolour.tv, Matthew's workshops that you've got as well. So this takes you back, and the simple thing, I say that, because if you've done the workshops before, which are phenomenal, limited spaces, but if they are phenomenal, you've got the right tools for the job. Because this is the thing that worries me with when I start when I start painting or you start doing any sort of project like this. If you've got the wrong tools for the job, you then think it's you. You then think, well, I can't do this because it's not me. And maybe you've done the workshops online before and you think, yeah, I, I really enjoy it, but what do I need? Matthew, you've got an amazing starter kit or an, an, an additional kit if you've already got the stuff already. Yeah, I've got to say, folks, that this one day special, it's a special one because it is very much a complete kit. With this one day special, you can do so much watercolour painting. Now, it's kind of focused around winter scenes and of course Christmas cards. We're giving you actually five uh, watercolour uh, greetings card sets here, so you can actually paint them yourself. You can see it here actually. So basically, five sheets of 100% cotton paper with the bevel mounts, with the envelopes, with the pre scored card as well. And this will allow you to produce some of these bees. Can we see these beautiful? Just knocked everything flying here, but can you see these? It's a great start. Can you see these beautiful <laughs> uh, greetings cards? It comes with the mounts, it comes with the colours for producing the paintings that are included on this almost, I'll pick those up, almost a four hour DVD because. We're giving you a double DVD, folks, in the one day special. Now, this is almost four hours. And on this DVD, if I turn it around here, these are the paintings you're going to produce. We can also see them around the studio as well. Here we can see actually painting a um, the greetings card um, actual lesson, which is about 35, 40 minutes worth of tuition. So with the tools we're giving you, with the paints, with the DVD, you'll produce... Um, this is one of the three paintings. And it is literally like these DVDs are like having you in the room, aren't they? You yeah, do go absolutely. through every single stage. You don't skip anything. It is a full, in fact, yeah, yeah. full lesson. So nothing's cut out of these, and that's important to me because that's the way that I would have wanted to be taught all those years ago. And this is the actual painting that you'll produce. This is kind of lesson one, if you like, here. Plus, we'll give you the colours and we'll give you the actual paper, the card. It's amazing. It really is all there. It's a super kit, and I've got to say, a cracking price at thirty-six ninety-nine as well. Um, just behind this, we can see another bonus lesson. Now, this winter landscape is also included on the DVD for you. This one's on for thirty-five minutes. Okay, it'll show you how to do the water, the trees, the sky. Again, using the colours from the one-day special. And my favourite, this star of the DVD. If we flip this over, we can see this beautiful scene of Ash Ness in the Lake District. Now, that is on for uh, one hour, 40 minutes, taking you through every single brushstroke to create that stunning painting. But you've got to think that it's not just about painting that scene. It's got skies, trees, mountains, water, how to do the beautiful shadows. Um, it really is a, cr a cracking full kit. So five sheets of paper with the um, the chance to frame them, mount them, turn them into those beautiful greetings cards. Three artist quality colours, which we can see here at the bottom. These are natural orange, which you can see is a beautiful, kind of nice autumnal it's colour. beautiful. Designed to replicate the autumn trees. These are called natural colours because it's focusing purely on what you see outside. Natural orange, perfect for the autumn, perfect for those beautiful skies. Natural blue is the perfect non-granulating blue for creating gorgeous skies, mixing shadows. And natural brown was, was pre-blended for replicating winter trees, branches, 
the beautiful water, any kind of detail from fence posts to those bearded shuffs in the sky. So a really full kit. And we can keep going because it's not just about the DVD, the paints, the card. We're going to give you this set of special watercolour blending blades. Now, these are brushes that I designed. We've not seen these for over a year, so these are back in stock after selling out last time. And these are designed for creating beautiful skies, making watercolour paint blend so, so easily. And that makes a big, big difference, it really does, because it's always difficult to make paint blend. These are designed specially for this, okay? And we'll see these in action a little bit later. And you get a small and you get the large as well. So a, a, a kind of a special effects set, if you like. Very unique brushes. And these aren't brushes that you can go out and buy from an art shop. These are very much all about here today. And then finally, because there's more to this kit, <laughs> we have this uh, brand new here today on, on a Chanda. This is the uh, SAA Masking Fluid Marker Pen. Masking Fluid in a pen that works. Now, we've been desperate for this in the art world for a long time because masking fluid, if you know what we're talking about, that liquid latex, okay. it kind of ruins your brushes. This, if we take the lid off of this and show you this, you can see it's actually in a marker pen. So you can get beautiful uh, fine lines here as well. And it, it doesn't clog the tip up and you can sort of draw with it rather than paint with it. So it'll never ruin the brushes and it's a gorgeous little tool. And masking fluid is designed for keeping areas of your painting white. For example, if we take a look at this painting here from the One Day Special DVD, the white was masked off with that pen before the ah. painting began. And you rub it off and it's, it's pure white. It's a beautiful um, thing to work on. So a very comprehensive kit. And like you said, it's not just for people that want to start out, but also people that have got some stuff on it take it a bit further. Special brushes, special paper. It's a complete kit, it really is. All of this for £36.99 and pence is what you're looking at. Uh, three hours and 40 minutes on the DVD across two DVDs. There are three large projects. You get the brushes where you can only get from us here on a Chanda. You can't get them anywhere else. You're getting the paint thrown in as well. You're getting the brand new masking fluid the brand new launch today. Now, you're getting all the paper as well. Everything you need in here as a complete kit for £36.99. And over the course of the next two hours, so now and eight o'clock and three hours tomorrow, you will see this kit in action from people like you sitting there. Us as presenters, yes, some of us have got creative backgrounds. Some of us haven't, like Leone and Paula, they have. Myself and Scott, we dabble, but we've never done it before. You will see what we can achieve when we try this one day special as well. £36.99, 050855 is your item number. If you want more of the greeting cards mounts though, because they are beautiful, you can get 15 more of them. Remember they're 300 GSM is what we're talking about for £16.99. The details for those currently are at the bottom of the screen just here. 900 839 is your item number. Then we've got your one day special. If you want to add on again, once again, great giftables these would be amazing giftables. Um, yes, it's winter and they're sort of Christmas cards, but you can sort of do them any year round if you're just practicing your techniques. Because Matthew summed it all up. What you've got in the DVDs for your one day special, you will carry across you to other projects that you go. Things like this, this is skies, trees and water. Once you've learnt skies, your trees and your water, you can then, Matthew, you can sort of create any landscape you want, can't you? Yes. So this DVD, yeah, it was actually my first DVD and it still is one of the most popular ones to this day. This one basically shows you how to do exactly what it says on the tin, <laughs> skies, trees, water. And that's on for two and a half hours and you'll produce some stunning uh, watercolours like we're just saying you can apply this to your own painting. It's not just about what you see on the DVD. Uh, you're also getting brushes included in here as well. So once again, if you're going for your one day special and your budget will stretch to it, you're going to get another two brushes for your collection, are you? And are these just for your skies, your trees, your water? Are these once again specially made? No, no, yourself? yeah. So these brushes again, like the blending blades from the one day special, these branching detail brushes 
are designed by me. It's a rigger brush on the inside. You can see that pointy, uh, sort of fine, sort of brown tip and surrounded by a dark hair which holds the water. Think about that as a water tank that gradually feeds the tip. A very special and very unique brush designed by myself. They are absolutely beautiful is what they are. Uh, they're blending with my trousers, you couldn't see them. Uh, there's so many things you can get, £24.99. You're saving £6.40 on this as well. 447077 is your item number. Now, whether you're coming back or once again you're just starting, you're thinking, I quite like this idea. I quite like this idea. I'd like some more of the paints as well. Once again, as the hours go on, you'll see Matthew using all these in different techniques and different shows. Uh, we've got a pick and mix on your paints. Now, I'm going to let you into a secret. Last time we had these on, they absolutely flew out of the door. £15.99 paints. You can choose any three of the colours that we've got here already. So you've got things like your natural orange, you've got your light green on here as well. Uh, you've got your natural turquoise on there. Uh, wasn't it the pearl that sold out the quickest last it time? It was the pearl and the silver. So these are the metallic ones. And I've got to say that we are talking about painting Christmas and seasonal scenes here. Silver and pearl is perfect for getting that beautiful metallic shine or that iridescence to your snow scenes. You're getting all your naturals as well. Natural yellow, natural brown, and also your violet in there as well. Um, a little goes an awful long way with these. You only need the smallest amount. They're going to last you an awful long time. For £15.99, getting quick, because I know pearl, silver will go straight away. They are the most popular by far. 679967 is your item number that we're looking at at the moment. And then we've got your watercolour palette. Now, what is so special about having a decent watercolour palette? Okay, so first of all, this palette was my design and this is the new improved 2020 edition. This is the Mark II. This one has got more, more mixing wells, more smaller areas to splodge your paint and leave it there. It comes with a sponge that allows you to lay it flat over the top to keep your paint moist and there's nothing better than moist paint is there you know you love moist paint and also it's got a beautiful shine to this you can see how shiny that is one side of the palette has got a silicon coating and not a single hard square corner which is why it's called an easy clean palette you can wipe it out beautiful i've been using the original design of this now for nine years and i've still got that same palette in action so it's worth having. So it is for £9.95. It is going to last you your watercolour journey. It really, good price really will. As well, that. Very good price. You can't go wrong. You're saving £3 on this as well. And remember, if you are going over that £60 mark, you can split the cost onto two interest free flexible payments if you wanted to as well. 936824 is your item number for your palette that we've also got on the show. Uh, then we've got more on the show as well. This show is rammed. If I was you, I'd jump ahead on the website if I were you because I've got so much to show you that I just can't cram in because we want to try and get three demos in if we can this hour as well uh, and show you all, uh, everything. Uh, we've got them well, now. We've got your yeah, schminky. Uh, you've got your masking pen as well. Uh, there is so much in this little collection. Now, this makes things glisten and shine, doesn't it? Gives you it that does, yeah. And we've got an example, actually, on the box at the back. So if you pick that up and give it a wiggle, you'll see that the actual uh, spot, they cut that beautiful. So you mix it with your paint or you paint it over the top. And what it does, it's basically like a mica-based gum arabic. So it's beautiful. One of our favorite mediums. It is beautiful. Look at that. So it does give you that crisp water on that snowy day if you wanted to. Uh, it also gives you that beautiful, that beautiful sort of snow sheen that you want to give there. So if we turn it away from the light, you can't really see much. The minute you hit the light, you're going to get that beautiful sparkle uh, time and time again. And it's absolutely beautiful. And once again, at a cracking little price at £14.99 is what you're looking at. 458059 is your item number. Um, the best thing to do... As I said before, we shop ahead of me. There really is shop ahead of me. Now, we've also got watercolour paints. These are brand new one I'm about to show you. These are beautiful. Now, we've got a set of three. So you can go for all of them if you want. The savings there. Uh, for the set of three, £115 and £115 and £97, and you're saving £4. Uh, but you've got flexible payments on this. You've got three flexible payments of £38 and £66. That's going to get you all the colours that you see in front of me now. 
okay all these colors if you want to go for them individually the details are at the bottom of the screens they're 40 pounds but you're going to get the colors in there once again um once again these are beautiful beautiful sets and they say it's perfect for the basic range but this is sort of this is a nice giftable for someone that wants to get into the world of painting as well isn't it it is and it's it's made up from variations of primary colors so basically what you've got here is you've got um, a set of, is it seven colours, is it, you're getting those, or is it eight colours? Eight colours, eight. eight colours, you know, primaries, different blues, different reds, different yellows, which you could always say is a good starter kit, always. Artist it, quality as well, so made with the finest pigments possible. It's worth having a little look through it, and it opens up a flexible basket, so if you're bowling for these and your one-day special, we imagine what you can create then. £38.66, and pence. Four nine two seven seven nine is your item number. And Ross, our producer, has found a little bargain. What have you found? Go on, show me. Uh, we've found two DVDs on here for £15.60. and pence. It's a half... It's buy one, get one free. Look, it's a half price deal is what you're getting here. £15.96 and pence is what you're looking at. 406-460 is your item number for all of these two DVDs. Oh, these are stunning little watercolour DVDs you got. Nice little giftable once again. If you're going for some of the other brushes that you want to go for, uh, it's worth having a little look. Now, something else that's worth having a little look for is the SAA. Um, Matthew, tell me more about the SAA because you get so many little goodies, don't you? You do, and actually, if you join the SAA, you can see it here, uh, via Hachanda, via the link, not the Add to Basket, remember that, folks, you're going to get a year's membership to the SAA, £45. What's really good about this is we will give you the standard membership kit plus a bit extra, and the bit extra is those set of uh, branch and detail brushes, uh, oh, which are worth £20.59, I want to say. So over £20 worth of uh, brushes for free. We'll also give you the subscription to Paint Magazine, which we can see just tucked here. The Paint Magazine is a glossy mag that is full of step-by-step -step articles. I write for this on a regular basis, and that's included. The, these get sent out to you six times a year. You get the catalogue, huge discounts, free shipping, all this business. There's a book on watercolours here. Took to the back of Fiverr to spend in the um, actual catalogue as well. But the SAA in the modern world um, is... is, is so much more than printed materials. It's got this massive online community, including over 700 hours of, of uh, video on demand tuition from the likes of myself and hundreds of other artists. That is included. Think of that famous TV streaming platform with a giant red N. You've kind of got that for art, basically, included with your membership, so it's really cool. This is for a year as well. And remember, we're going to give you the brand new detail brushes, which are worth over £20 as well, if you join via the link on the Hachanda website. And when we talk about the link, the do not order from that item number. What you do is you click on the product on the website, then you scroll down. Do not add to basket. Scroll all the way down, and then you'll see a little link saying, click here for the SAA membership. You click there, and that's how you get your goodies. That's how you're gonna get those freebies, those branch and details brushes. Without the clicking that link, you will not get them. Okay, so you have to do it that way. Do not add it to your basket. Right then, you've seen everything I've got on the show, your one day special. My word, it is very, very busy for your one day special as well. We're already 15% of the stock now has already gone. Right then, let's go over for our first demo uh, with our Matthew. Right, so all set for these folks. Now, remember this one day special is about greetings cards and all the other bits we're going to include. So I've taken a sheet of the uh, greetings card paper. Now, it's worth saying this paper is 100% cotton. This is as good as it gets paper. This is premium textured watercolour, let's call it canvas as opposed to um, actual paper because it's cotton, okay? Now here we've got the beautiful uh, masking fluid marker pen. Love these. I've been painting for a long time, I've been painting for 30 years and I've been teaching for 22 years this year, <laughs> okay? That wasn't a cough by the way. No, I just want to make that clear. That wasn't a cough. All right. <laughs> this, that was like 22 and this, years. <laughs> and I've been waiting for a masking fluid marker pen or some kind of a pen that works and this does the SAA have nailed it so first time I've seen this give it a shake and a bit of a press and it comes out clear now I'm going to paint a bit of a 
a wintry scene here, folks. And I want to use this to draw. This is great. So I'm actually drawing masking fluid. Now, that's brilliant because that's something that we've never been able to do as efficient as this. Now, we've all seen those masking fluid nibs where it comes out in a huge blob and you spend more time mopping up. This comes out fine. It's it's a yellow coloured masking fluid so you can see where you stick it, which is important. And then I want to pop in another one here, just at the side. And I want to put some of these little bits. I want to pop a few little bits of dots in the sky as well. Now, masking fluid is latex. It's liquid latex. And it takes a few moments to dry, but you can slightly speed up that process by using the hairdryer. Not too close because it can um, over dry if that makes sense but a bit of a dry would be quite nice now most people ask me is painting on an easel something that you tend to do well it's not no it, it, this is more for demo you know this is for demonstration just get a table get a brew and just sit back and enjoy and with the one day special with those three colors it's worth saying that the colors in the one day special are actually designed by me to replicate nature. And that's the same as the pick and mix as well. We've got the gorgeous blending blades. And like I say, it's the first time we've seen these since they sold out um, last year, actually. These are designed for one size longer than the other. It's a special hair that we designed for creating multicolored effects and reactivating watercolor. That's an important thing to say. So my first job here is to use the large one and bring it down towards the bottom so I'm wetting the paper this is what you call wetting wet which is always an important thing to do uh, it lets the paint flow basically I'm gonna bring that down and straight in to the palette now I want to take a little bit of the orange I'm gonna pop it on one side of the brush and then take some of the blue and pop it on the other side of the brush so, I don't know if you can see that, we've actually got a brush made up of two colours. Now, it stays where it's put, and that's what's special about this hair. We can paint across. So, you can create an instant sky, look how lovely that is. And it just basically gives you more than one colours in one stroke. Now, that's pretty impressive, folks, it works really well. So, obviously, it's an evening. It's an evening atmosphere that we're going for here. It's nice. Nice warm colours. Let that kind of fade away. Now. One of the biggest problems that people have with skies and any kind of watercolour big wash is trying to get everything done at the point of the paper being wet because it dries quickly because it's water. This paper obviously um, it's cotton so it absorbs it, it stays wetter longer which is a good thing. But having the blending blades for the first time it doesn't matter how wet or dry this thing is. So if I take some orange nice and thick natural orange included beautiful for those autumnal scenes and of course at the minute it's out in force is old autumn so we've got orange on one side pop the blue on the other side and i'll pop a little bit of brown in there as well because natural brown's included in the in the kit as well so often in a sunset you get silhouetted clouds two colors and it it's held in place this shape is designed for painting perfect clouds that's why it's got that shape the original design was going to be called the cloud painting brush or the sky <laughs> brush, but we changed it to blending blade because it's so much more versatile than that. Twist along the paper, move it across, and you get that nice colour of a cloud. Turn the brush over, and we'll do another cloud, like a nice kind of silhouette cloud coming across. Now, at the minute, the paper's pretty much dry, as we mentioned. So I want to go in and I want to soften that in. Now, normally, if you painted a sky like this, an evening sky, and the paint wasn't blending you've kind of shot it you've lost out but with blending blades and this is the thing to try and put across it allows you to go in with water and reactivate the color which is great so using the point of it you can tick all the edge even if this was left a couple of days you can go back to it which i've never been able to say before because it's always been a case to get it done while it's damp so for the first time, even working other colours in, if I want to get some dark in those clouds, I can take some blue and I can pop some blue in there as well. And this is what's really clever about them. Blue and brown. Blue and brown. Blue and brown. Blah, blah, blah. Make grey. 
which is uh, nice for shadows. So clean the brush, gentle pinch through the fingers. You can go horizontally across the base of these things. You can soften them in and it turns them into clouds. Because it's a blade, one side longer than the other, you can also lift colour off, which is really cool, even if the paint's dry. Can you see, you can get those underlit effects yeah. to the clouds. So I'm wiping it and I'm dragging it up from the base of the cloud and I can, I can just kind of tickle the edge and you get these lovely looking skies. Keep refreshing it. The hair is almost like a stiff fishing wire, if that makes any sense. It's a very special hair. Also works with acrylics and oils as well, which is really nice. So a gentle tap on the edge. I just feel like I want to get a bit more blue in there. So I'm just going to bring some more blue in. So you can manipulate the colours in the paper, which is a really nice thing to do. And something that we could never really do before, because once it's dry, it's dry but not with the blending blade. Then we'll take some blue, put it across the bottom for the minute. Now, blending is the number one problem people have without question. That's when, where people struggle. Taking that colour, making it fade away. These brushes were designed with this in mind. Clean it, a gentle pinch through your fingers and it's, it's just simple just to take that colour, swipe it from side to side because of the stiff nature of the bristle, it just instantly disappears away. I'm also going to paint in on this one. Because of the pointy brush, I'm going to bring in some distant hills coming across here. And then again, we'll clean that brush and just use a bit of water to blend it down, make it disappear. And that's giving me a sky and a bit of landscape. I can drag out some light as well because of the blade on the brush and what I'm going to do is I'm going to come back to that after it having a few seconds to dry and painting some trees and some lovely detail. Right All then, right. why we leave that to dry and we will be back to that shortly, you see how quick once you have the right tools for the job you are good to go and so far Matthew's only used the three colours that are in your one day special and one brush. The 300 GSM card site that's in there as well three colours and one brush. And so far we've created that stunning scene. Oh, and we've used the fluid pen as well, the masking fluid marker. And so far we're one step ahead and we've not even touched about the three hours and 40 minute DVD that we've got there as well, across two DVDs to create beautiful imagery that you see in front of me. So this beautiful set of trees that you got there and the pictures that we've got behind, these are the projects that are on the DVDs that you will be able to do. And this is the bonus of doing it at home. You've got that DVD, so maybe you spend the first, the half, the first half of your morning sitting and just watching the DVD. Just sitting and watching ahead so you know what you're about to do. You know what you're coming up to. And you sit there and you think, right, this is what we're going to do today. This is how I'm going to watch it. So I'll watch it all first. I'll watch the project so I can get the end goal in set. And once I've got that end goal, then I will go back and do a little bit. And then I'll pause it. And you might want to rewind it. Because if you're in a class, you can't stop and go back. Because you may have 30, 40 other people sitting there. With the luxury of this, for £36.99, you can go back as many times as you want. And whether you do those three projects over the next week, you've still got that th over three hours DVD of hints and tips to go back to and refresh your mind every single day you want to go and paint. You're not going, they're not going to go anywhere. Those DVDs are yours to keep. And once you have got the skills under your belt, you can paint other images that you see around here, like your robins and your seascapes and the night skies as well. This is what you can achieve because basically you've got the basics. It's like riding a bike. Once you can learn to ride a bike, then you can take your stabilers off. And once you've got those stabilizers off, that's the cause of the DVD. They are going to be your stabilizers. They are going to guide you through your painting journey until you feel comfortable to actually I can do trees and skies and foregrounds now. I know what I'm about to do, so now I'll go on my own and I'll give it a go. Oh, but then I've got no colours. Well, you have, because you've got three in the kits already that will do those beautiful autumnal scenes that you want them to do. Then you've got the two brushes that are going to give you your foregrounds, your backgrounds, your blending brushes, time and time again. And then you've also got the cards. Remember the brushes sold out last time? This is the first time they've been back in over a year. 
36 pounds and 99 pence today 050855 is your item number that you'll be looking at for all of the kits that you see here what a cracking little christmas gift or even better a christmas card that you have painted for that loved one yes you start now and you maybe gift it the middle of december once you're happy with it but you can do it. it's something they'll cherish and something they'll keep and they may even frame it as well because that was your first artwork that's the first bit of work that you actually did you see and I know I speak quite passionately because it is something I would love to be able to do. Drawing is something I, I look at people standing here and I think, I wish I could do that. I wish I could do that. And I'm quite lucky because I have the opportunity to do it that you'll see as we go through this hour as well. I have never painted before. And if you could see me before this hour, I'm nervous is not the word because we're live television and if I can do it on here you can do it in your own home as well right then let's go back to Matthew to see uh, this little bit of artwork and then we'll go from there uh, where are we up to this is nice and dry over here and I'm, I'm painting those trees the masking fluid is in place it's dry so I want to use the smaller uh, blending blade and again we're going to use the orange and the blue to make a dark green there's lots of yellow in orange so it's quite easy to get green so we'll take the orange mix it with blue and you'll get a nice sort of look at that beautiful sort oh, of yeah. pine almost petrol green okay now I want, because of the nature of the brush and the nice shape of it that beautiful point and again one side is longer than the other it's designed that way very popular brushes these um i've, I've lost count of how many times we've sold out of them um especially during all the lockdown because people were just buying all this stuff because people wanted to get into art, which obviously it's a great medium in troubled times. And are these the sorts of paintbrushes, Matthew, that you use when you do do your class? Yeah, we talk about your classes and the stuff you can do online, but is these the sorts of things you can use when you do your classes as well? Absolutely, yeah, 100%, yeah. So all these colours are all, and all these brushes are all used at my my classes, whether online or, or in person classes. And um, yes, 100%. Um, and everything I've designed, brushes wise, paints wise, it's all designed to make life easier. Can you see I'm tapping the side of the blade here just to give yeah. that impression of those individual branches, the foliage of these classic pine trees. And we can get nice fine points at the top like you would expect to do. Now I'm just going to add a bit more blue to that colour to make it a little bit darker and just pop in a bit of dark on one side and at the bottom as well. Beautiful. Now, so three colours, not primary colours, but three colours. We've already had browns, we've had blues, we've had oranges, we've had greens. How do we get a grey? The most important colour is grey because it's the colour of shadows. How do you get grey? It's dead easy from this one day special blue and brown this special blend of brown look at that beautiful shadow color yeah instantly which is exactly what you want for this um lights come in this way i'm going to say so i want to pop in some shadows from the trees again with the blending blade it wouldn't matter if the paint was dry or damp because of the nature and i suppose this is where the palette comes in handy as well doesn't it Matthew? it is it's a so gorgeous little palette yeah you can leave this paint in there you know it won't stay and it won't damage it or anything it's just designed for the job now what I want to do here I want to take a, a scrap piece of paper I'm just going to take a, a rough sort of ripped off piece of paper I want to pop it just to the side of the uh, those pine trees come back to the small blending blade and we'll take some of the brown and give it a stipple now if I stipple the blade it goes a bit spiky we can use that spiky property for stippling in trees. So we can stipple in, imagine distant fields, a distant hedgerow. Now, if I go vertically, and I do a lot of these vertical lines, you almost get that impression of distant, a distant pine forest, okay? Now in a second, I'll take the card away. Hopefully you realize why the card's there because it gives me that nice clean, look at that. And then oh. we'll just pop over here, do a little bit in the gap, and then we'll stipple here. Because of the stiff bristle, you get a lovely random edge every time you stipple the brush in the, in the palette. Pop some little tiny 
pine trees here. And remember all the colours that you currently seeing in the artwork here, you are getting in your one day special. You can achieve, if you want extra colours, I've got them on the show as well. Um, I've got more in pick and mix form, I've got them in the tins as well. But all these colours that you're seeing at the moment are all in your one day special. So I'm just going to finish this picture off by a stippling in the corner, some little bits of random sort of foliage if you like. You can see how spiky the brush goes. It's a, th it's a synthetic bristle that is exclusively designed for the blending blades. So if we were to pop that in the foreground, say here, it'll pop some little winter foliage on, bring the brush back together by smoothing it through the palette so it's now nice and clean again. And then we can use the blade properties of the brush to put in a lovely sort of rustic old gateway that's kind of seen better days. We've all seen them when you've been out walking in the countryside, but that just gives a bit of foreground character. Again, one brush doing so much work, folks, it's lovely. Now, I'm just going to um, make sure that I'm happy that the trees are nice and dark here and give this a good old blast with... <laughs> I always expect this to be so loud because I'm used to using <laughs> hair dryer. Like, whoosh, it's like, it's a but this is a, um, <laughs> this is a emboss it heat tool. <laughs> Uh, while we dry that, we, we might as well give it another another little plug. But you do do, because uh, your, your courses are really popular that you do, because many people have, to, have taught themselves, many people, Joe Tanning is the biggest person, that, like, she has loved, she's been to one of Matthew's workshops, uh, and she's dying to go back again. But if you're thinking you really want to get into this, there are places out there, Matthew does online courses still to this day, but they're massive around the world, aren't they now? This is yeah. really taking off since all this has yeah. sort of happened. So normally I spend my year sort of travelling the UK and teaching in person, but all that's just stopped. So I've been teaching online for quite some years, but just recently, every single week, a weekly virtual workshop. It's this Friday the 23rd, and we're painting penguins in the Antarctic. Step-by-step -step workshop, folks. What colour TV is the place? But people around the world have been doing this, and I've been blown away by the amount of people that's been uh, taking part. Have a look on the Facebook page, Matthew Palmer Artist. You'll see what people's been achieving. Yeah, have you a will. look, and it is worth having a look because you you'll get loads of inspiration uh, from there as well. Right, then let's quickly go back to demo because uh, I think we're nearly done. I'm going to take off the uh, masking fluid, okay. which you can use your finger for. It rubs off, or you can use an eraser, like I've got here, and we can see the falling snow, and we can see the snow look at this. on the. Look at that! Love that. So, it, remember, this is the masking fluid pen, which is just crazy. Now. Don't get this mixed up with those metal nibs that you've seen around that blobs everywhere. These are actual, it's a physical marker pen, like a classic marker pen, but with masking fluid, and it creates a gorgeous scene. Now remember, these are in the uh, greetings cards kit. It includes the bevel mounts. Now, how wonderful would that be oh, to receive something like that, that in the post? A beautiful evening uh, winter landscape. You. you can achieve this as well for thirty-six pounds and ninety-nine pence. Five zero zero. Uh, f I'll start that again. Zero five zero eight five five is your item number. We are twenty percent of the one-day special stock now has already gone. You are getting uh, the two designed paintbrushes by Matthew himself uh, to give you these beautiful landscapes that you've just seen. Use these are the only brushes that Matthew's been using in that first demonstration. You're also getting your brand new. Um, masking fluid marker in there as well from the SAA so you know it's going to be top quality. You're getting your two DVDs in there over three hours of tutorial, one-to-one -one tutorial is what you're going to be getting in there. You're getting your 300 GSM, uh, your cardstock in there, your mounts and also your frames. And we're also throwing in the paints as well. And across that DVD, you're going to be getting three cracking little projects to learn so much more. Uh, also, remember, there's a few of you popping the SAA uh, bundle in your baskets, but we don't pop them in our baskets. You have to go to their website. OK, what you do is you click onto it on our website. So once you've clicked onto it, you scroll down. Do not add it to your basket, but you scroll all the way down is what you're going to do. And from there, you press 
click here for SAA membership, okay? That is where you click. Once you've clicked that, then it'll go through. Then you're gonna get those free brushes as well uh, when you join, so that's the way you actually join. Right then, I can't string this out any longer. I've tried to. Uh, it's time for me to demo, okay? We've got 15 minutes left on the show. What are we doing? I thought we'd finished. <laughs> <laughs> and I did. <laughs> What we're going to do is I'm going to paint, I'm going to teach, and I've got to say that since March, which is when all this craziness started, I've not actually been out physically teaching in person much, so <laughs> this is a treat to do this. It's all been done virtually, which is great, I'm loving it, but here we go. So, there's a long space between there's us, lot, there's, there's a good, what, um, six metres between us? Easily, we're Easy. the other side of the studio. Minimum at least, so we've got to shout here. So. Um, Again, from the one day special. So just think about this. If you're buying the one day special, which lots of you are, so thank you. But just remember that the pictures okay, that we're that doing one. are using wow. the brushes and the colours and the paper from the one day special. Okay? Okay. I've got you on like three monitors. <laughs> I'm excited for you. I really am. So right, what I'm going to do first is I'm going to use a bit of masking tape. You've got some sort of stuck on the table there. Yeah. Um, be creative in the way that you take the stickiness off. So you can stick it to your forehead or to your chin or something, or somewhere moist. Stick it somewhere moist. <laughs> that, that could be anywhere at the moment, I'm not going to lie. Could be anywhere. And, and if you divide the painting into thirds, loosely, so it's a, sort of one, two, three, loosely in your mind, divide it into thirds. And okay. what we'll do is we'll make the masking tape go up on an angle, like this. Can you see it's hanging loose on one side? Yeah. And then follow it with your finger, turn it round so it creates a bit of a hill. So Ooh. you've created a bit of a mound, a bit of a hill. Are you with me on this? Yeah, I'm with you. Follow the curve. Now, if you're not happy with your mound, you can take it off and you can create another bit of a mound. So as long as it's got a bit of a hill to it, you'll be fine. We've also uh, got a coin wrapped in tissue here as well. And this is a, a penny or a five pence or something. Yeah, Some I'm there. small coin. So that'll put the moon or the sun, depends on, on what colours we decide okay. to use. Pick up the large blending blade, give it a good old rinse around in the water, okay? And there. Um, it's a good habit just to wipe off the excess on the side of the water pot, okay? Before you wet the paper. So make sure that tape's stuck down well, and then I want you to wet the top section. Now, it'll involve a couple of dabs in the water, but wet it down to the tape, just like you put in some emulsion paint on at home, that kind of thing. Yeah. Keep sticking it in the water, wet it twice, Wet it twice, so you've got a nice coverage of water, and then you're ready to do some multicolour watercolours. I'm there. Now I'm what with we'll you. do, we'll go back in the water, wipe it on the side of the water pot, okay, and then on one side of the brush, grab some of the orange. On the big side or the little side? Well, you can choose. Oh. You can choose. No pressure. On the other side, pick up some of the blue and sort of rub it in your palette like this. On the other side. So it kind of gets the brush that looks a bit like that. So like a sort of double colour brush. Does yeah. that make sense? Yeah? Have you got a double colour brush? Almost hold the brush towards the bottom, lay it flat to your paper and twist. Twist away. Make it flat and twist. I'm going to create a moody nighttime sky. Literally flat to your paper. I'll say twist it away. Now if it starts to run out of juice, turn the brush over and you'll get a bit more out of it. Because of the special bristle that's in this, this is how you make a cloudy sky. Oh. Now what I suggest you do is go back into the water again, clean it, wipe it on the side, make the paint a bit stronger, make it a bit thicker. So more orange, more orange, more orange and more blue, but a bit stronger, a bit deeper more with your blue. colours. Yeah. And then back to your paper and do more twisties. So imagine a nighttime sky, but make your colour darker. Go right to the top as well. Take it right to the top. Right to the top. Make it darker at the top. Bring it all the way down to the tape. Proper wintry, stormy kind of sky. Love that. Look at that. Can't go wrong, can you, Ray? Now, yours is quite dry, so what I suggest you do is clean the brush really well. Yeah. Give it a wipe on the side, and then go over all of it, flat to your paper, spinning your brush, twisting your brush. So you can create that wonderful effect of uh, the paint blending together again. It's never been so quiet in the studio. <laughs> you, can hear a, you can hear a pin drop. And then what we'll do is we'll take the coin, and if you choose a nice place, you can stamp it, and you'll get a bit of a moon. Look at that. A spooky Halloween oh. moon. Press it firm. Go for it. Go on. 
<gasps> Look at that. I think you should have a round of applause because that one people <laughs> in the studio. <laughs> oh my God, I'm sweated. <laughs> You can smell the fear. Now what, <laughs> now what we'll do is we'll pick up the smaller brush. Okay. The small brush. And we'll mix the blue yes. and the brown together to make a grey. Okay. okay. So, so it's the blue. You can mix it around in your palette like this and we can see the palette where, where you are. But you mix it around in your palette. So it's the blue and a blob of the brown. And you'll see it start to go grey. A nice thick dark colour. And a blob of the Grey is the most important colour for watercolours because it's the colour of shadows. Okay, so it's it's important basically. Mine's gone black. That's fine. Black brown. Okay. There's not much in it. There's not much in it really. It's not true black unless you use black paint. Oh, okay. And we don't want black. It's too dark. Now, literally, in the lower part of your tape, so mine's on the right side. Yours is probably the same. Um, do some telegraph poles. About three or four. I've got five. Different heights, different height telegraph Ooh, poles. Mine are thick. Doesn't matter how thick they are, really. And then if you use one of the flat sides of the blade, you can just sort of do one side of the pine tree at a time. Sort of tap it. You go. He's going up. Now I'll keep doing these for you so you can see. If we can get nice and close to that, can we get nice and close so we can see? Is that as close as we can get, is it? And Basically, I can use the blade to lightly stroke the paint, doing one side at a time, getting them all mixing together. Ah. So if you do, you start off with that straight line, it makes it a little bit easier. Mm, might look like pine cones, but we'll get them there. Now, if you look here, your paper's still damp, okay, because it wants to be spread in. It's what you call, it, it's what you call bleeding paint. Perfect. Now, <laughs> yours are looking a little bit as though the tops have been chopped off. So I'd make them taller? So what we'll do is we'll, if you have a look at this, I'll use the blade and tap it on the side, at the top. Some little oh, taps at the top. Taps on the top. And do some in between as well. Little random tall. Does that make sense? Little sort of taps and you get that instant yeah. sort of pine, sort of moody atmospheric, sort of loving the Halloween sky there, looks lovely. Feel free to rotate your board as well, you know, okay. if you f to get a better angle. That's a common thing really, you know, rotating it around. But if you imagine the brush on one side of it's got this straight edge, you can literally lay it flat on your paper and tap it. You can put as many as you like, do some smaller trees, look, little... Oh, on that one. Little taps. Okay, little taps. Little taps. Using better. the side of the blade. And also, make sure that the bottom, down to the tape, is nice and full. A good, solid bottom is what you're looking for, yeah? Make sure... <laughs> <laughs> make sure... Make sure it's nice and solid, yeah? Solid bottom. Solid bottom. Yep, i got one of them. Have you got a solid bottom? I have you? indeed. I've had no complaints. <laughs> Let's have a look at your bottom, shall we? Can I see your bottom? Oh, uh, there. There we go. Nice. Okay. Just to the left, where it sort of disappears at the back of the tape, if you just do some individual taps, just what, little here? vertical taps. Can you see this? Can you see what yeah, I'm doing? Yeah, I can see you. Yeah. It'll sort of... Nice. Imagine they're the kind of distant sort of... distant sort of trees, that's it. Different heights. Use the blade. And then, this is the bit where people come unstuck. Are you ready? I'm ready. Take your tape off, but do it oh, nice and carefully. Yeah. Peel it down nice and steady. And it should reveal a wintry sort of hillside. Pull it That's away me. from it That's and do me. it steady, otherwise it can rip. So just do it nice and slow. Nice. And if you look back at this, you get that instant kind of wintry feel. Beautiful. Nice. That's it, you can breathe again now. <laughs> now, let's pick up the um, large blending blade, nice and clean, in the water. Nice and clean. Just to finish off, nice and clean for the blending blade. Give it a good old rinse around. Don't got dry it. six minutes left, we've got. Don't dry it, just give it a clean. A gentle oh. wipe on the side of your water pot, but no yeah. tissue, just okay. a gentle wipe. Pick up some of the blue, but not too thick. So if you need to add a bit of water, can you see my palette? That's not a strong colour at all, that one. It's just a... 
Notice I turn the brush over because the bristle keeps the paint in place. It's a good idea to load both sides. Not too thick with the blue. Okay. Okay. Nice water, for right? this one, the paper's dry where the tape was. What we'll do is put that shadow in. Let me do it first, and you can yeah, sort of do it afterwards. Yeah. So I want I want to paint across the bottom, probably about an inch tall on the left, but then make it smaller to the right, like a tapered line. This is why we have blending blades. Clean the brush really well, and then just wipe off that excess on the side again. So all you've got there is a bit of dampness, yeah? Okay, so, okay. Then, so an inch. Put it just on the edge, and just go forward and back in oh, it. Okay. It just smoothly, look at that, love it, smoothly disappears. You can go back down and blend it, blend it, blend it. And you've created a wintry landscape. And then dry it off. With the mount on, of oh, course. Look at it. If mine turns out like I'll be go. well happy. So if you stop there, clean the brush really well again. A couple of wipes on the side of the uh, water pot, and just continue on that top hard line where the blue is. Not forward, back, like you're putting emulsion paint on. Forward, back, forward, back. Drag the paint away, down to the bottom. Move it up. Keep it going. Keep it flowing. And can you see how simple that is oh, to no. blend? Oh, no, I'm now the line you've just dragged out there looks quite nice it looks like a shadow i was meant to do that intentional of course of course it was you can actually use some of the blue to pop in some some of these can you see there's little shadows like this little sort of almost like a diagonal shadow from the trees as well oh, word. optional of course for that one can you see those shadows yeah the shadows go notice the angle of those it's kind of pointing what to about eight o'clock ish Something like that, slight, slight downward angle. Probably about an inch long. And then clean the brush really well, wipe it front and back, front and back, front and back. And ever so gently, just kind of soften the shadows into the picture just by lightly skimming over the top of the colour. And it creates a wonderful, I'll pop the mount on there, but a wonderful little atmospheric nighttime winter scene. Again, smashing uh, Christmas card there. Yeah, there. nice, well done. Pop the mount on. I've got oh, to say that, well done. That. I think you need a, there's three people in the studio who can give me a little <laughs> clap, shall we, for that one. Bless you. <laughs> uh, oh my word, Matthew, thank you ever so much. That, I can now breathe now. It's I literally, conquered your fear of pain. You do not know. It's come out lovely I, as well. The it's last nice. 24 hours, I've, been, I've literally been, because, and I, and I genuinely say it when I mean it, that, I don't craft, I craft with my daughter and that's about it. We use Crayola colours and things like that and that's all we use. Watercolours and things for me is something I would love to do and obviously I knew this was coming up like I was told the other day and I was like, oh my word, I'm never going to be able to do it. I, I, they're the words I didn't use. I used some stronger words. Uh, but I thought I'm never going to be able to do it. I can't paint. But then they said, well, trust in Matthew. Matthew will know what you were doing. You can do it. And if I can achieve this on live TV, yes, we were time constrictions are against us on television, but you will have more time and you'll also have the DVD at home as well that will be able to do this. Um, but what you could do and what I could have done is became a member of the SAA and then I'm going to have more wealth and more knowledge and I get so much in the kits as well. Don't yes, Matthew? you do. So, uh, and again, folks, if you join the SAA through the link on the channel website, not the Add to Basket, you're going to get this beautiful membership kit for a year, including all the online stuff, the video on demand, the community, a £5 voucher to spend within the subscription to the magazine, a set of Matthew Palmer branch and detail brushes, which is worth £20.59, pence, um, and a wonderful box with everything thrown in to uh, come across to your catalogues, you get a book on art. It's a great little kit, folks. Encourage anybody who's into painting to join the SAA. It is indeed. Here's another look at the SAA that you've got here as well. £45, but do not add it to your basket. Please do not scroll all the way down. And there is a little link saying click here for SAA membership. Click it there and then that is how you will become part of the SAA. But I must tell you now, your one day special is phenomenally busy. You are getting everything that you see here and more as well.
You will get a quarter of the stock now has already gone in the launch hour. You are getting a DVD of just under four hours worth of material that you've got on there to create three stunning images, three beautiful paintings that you're going to be able to do as well. And remember, you're learning techniques, hints and tips. It's the techniques that you will take with you to do other projects as well. This is another one of the projects that you'll be able to do upon that DVD. Remember, you're getting everything you need in the kit from brushes to colours to the card, to the 300 GSM, and you're also getting the masked fluing pen as well, which we will go through over the next couple of hours. This is what you'll get on the DVD. So once again, it's like having Matthew in the room with you and you can stop and pause at any point and go all the way back. Uh, thank you, Matthew. It's been an absolute pleasure uh, for this hour. Uh, Matthew, back at eight o'clock with our Leone painting along this time as well. And then all day tomorrow, you've got two from Leone and then you've got Paola Paola, then you've also got Scott tomorrow at four o'clock as well. I'll be watching that. Uh, don't you go anywhere. Start checking out your baskets if I was you because I don't want you to miss out on your one day special or anything else that we've also got on the show as well. 050855 is your item number. 36 pounds and 99 pence is your price. Don't you go 